originating from the French Riviera, so many Bula Bay's recipes call for an assortment of fish, accommodating not just the variety but the uncertainty of what ends up being a day's catch. Whole sunfish with this assemblage of a few days catches, a walleye carcass, the same as the Aubre Blanc, and some largemouth bass fillets, what remains in the freezer. With its many ingredients, a Bula Bay's complex, exotic flavor is built up from the humble fumé. Four tablespoons of unsalted butter. Three smashed cloves of garlic. Two quartered onions. One peeled and chopped carrot. Bouquet garni. A pinch of salt. Three quarter cups of a dry white wine. A walleye and six sunfish bones and a bit of water makes the stock. Turn the burner to medium-high heat. To melt the butter, ensuring not to let it get warm enough to take any color. Sweat. Remove the excess liquids of the onions, carrot, and garlic for three to four minutes. Add the fish bones. And like the vegetables, cook for only a few minutes. After the wine is poured and the bouquet garni is placed, add about 10 cups of water, whatever is needed to just cover the hard matter. As the mixture rises to a boil, Ladle out any scum that comes to the surface. Once boiling, let simmer for 20 minutes. Remove all the hard matter before straining the fumé. These fillets will be poached in the soup right before serving, cut into preferred size. These are roughly bite-sized. Marinate in just enough olive oil to cover and a fourth of an orange rind minced. cloves of smashed garlic, half a fennel bulb diced, three celery stalks sliced, saffron threads, star anise, tomato paste, and salt, olive oil, one leek diced, two quarts of fumé, six sunfish fillets skinned and deboned, Heat up the olive oil. Begin with the aromatics. Sweat for a few minutes. Now the garlic and the fish. Again, cook for only a few minutes. Fumé follows. Bouquet 
Garni. Seasonings. Salt to taste. Most recipes call for even more saffron. And finally, two heaping tablespoons of tomato paste. Bring to a boil and simmer for 30 minutes. Remove the star anise and bouquet garni before blending the soup smooth. Strain soup. A majority of the nutrients have been transferred into the broth, as evidenced by its changed color and development of flavor. Mostly, it's fiber that's being strained out. As can be imagined, how more rustic, thick, latent with bone and husks and dirt this soup would have been when first devised by the ancient Greek settlers of Marseille. The contemporary versions, modern conveniences lending a supernatural aurora, have evolved to something closer to ambrosia, what Vulcan would have expected from Venus. Bring the soup to a boil. Add the fish to poach, cooking until the fish is just done. This soup is traditionally served with croutons, some sharp cheese, and a ruya sauce. This sauce is similar to a garlic mayonnaise, but with a spicy kick. Spread the ruya atop a crouton. Place a pinch of cheese. and gently float in the boulebets. A tiny ship floating in the sea. Ulysses, perhaps, wandering home. Bon appetit! <laughs>